All right, are you giving dad the standard tie for Father's Day? Do you want to help out his career a little bit? With us this morning, image consultant and our friend, success coach, Lisa Maley, to share tips to buying power ties for dad for Father's Day. Thanks for being Hi. with us. We're so glad you're here. Thank you. Okay, so this is one of those things where we sort of kind of chew our fingernails a little bit. Should we even be getting dad a tie for Father's Day? That's the first question we always ask, right? And then where mm -hmm. do we go from there? So is it okay to get dad a tie? It is, but let's make it less disastrous. Okay. okay? <laughs> so okay. it always helps, for example, if you remember that clothes are language. Right. And in the workplace, they can say very important things about you that you can't say with words. For example, like you're important and professional and on your way up. So we know in an interview, for example, your image is your visual resume. But every day also at work, your appearance reflects your company's reputation. So your tie is the focal point because it's second only to your face. And hopefully it's going to make a statement that you're successful. I love that. Okay, so let's start, Lisa, because I think this is interesting. You brought with you some rather expensive ties mm -hmm. that you think are poor choices. These are not great choices for men. Talk to me, mm -hmm. first of all, about why they're so expensive and, and when they don't even look mm -hmm. that good. Maybe they're not even the best. What, what is your sort of opinion of these? Well, it helps to know the rules. So if we're looking at ties, the best is silk. Mm -hmm. And in the strongest colors and patterns, these are not. Okay. So can we start over here with oh, the good sure, ties? Sure. Absolutely. Okay, solids always work. Okay. A red silk solid. This was Burlington for $4.99. You're kidding. It's on so many executives I've bought it for because it reads like a $100 tie. This bright blue is also very effective. It reads friendly and authoritative. It too okay. was Burlington less than $10. Wow. So besides solids, we have stripes. Stripes in a bold color. I personally prefer red with a white stripe because that really pops on a white shirt. But these both were TJ Maxx less than $12. Wow. You you're too good. I'm going to go shopping with Well, you. good. That'll be fun. <laughs> the next tie pattern that's effective is a polka dot okay. or a foulard, which is a small pattern that's repeated. And these were Ross, both less for 12. Okay. And we end with Paisley, always effective. It could I be, love Paisley. I do too. A throwback to the yes. 60s and 70s. I huh? have to sort of talk my husband into mm -hmm. it, but now he likes Did it too. Did you? Yes. Good. So good going. the ladies have to encourage. Good. Right? It can be a red Paisley or this embossed blue. You know, these both were Marshalls less okay. than 10 and then let's end with these bad ties. Okay, okay. Okay. A client actually gave me this one when we were consulting in his closet because he was so mad he paid $75 for it oh. but then realized how pale it was that it projects forgettable instead right. of memorable. Right. And this would be memorable but for the wrong reasons, right? It's a $50 tie. Look, I paid oh $50 for this to show you today. But here's the thing. Now, I look at this and I think sort of mm -hmm. fun maybe or or somebody who's got a lot of energy but but no. So you would say that doesn't pr project that for well, most in a, people. In a creative field, you okay. can get away with it. But okay. for most people who work in conservative industries, right. they need to tap into power colors like you are today. Okay. And okay. the reason why red works the best is because successful men wear dark suits. So black, navy blue, gray, with a crisp white shirt. And those are on either end of the color spectrum where red splits it. I gotcha. Which is why it reads bold. I got gotcha. you. That and makes sense. This is probably the worst color you could wear. Again, yeah, a, really a client bad. gave that to me and said, take it out of my closet, please. What is this like? Would you call this burnt orange? Like Lisa? a burnt orange, a rust. Yeah. Yeah, yes. That's not attractive. Never read successful. All right. Thank you so much. That was really interesting. You're welcome. Amazing. We always enjoy having you. Well, thank you. you. Pleasure to be here. All right. Let's send it over to Michelle. That